Rockland County school officials are breathing a little easier tonight after apparently weathering another wave of COVID absences that threatened to close schools. WKRG News 5's Debbie Williams is joining us live. Now, Debbie, a positive trend in the number of students and staff absent because of COVID. That's right. You know, and in about an hour, we're going to get another set of numbers, the, the most recent numbers. But in the last two weeks, those COVID numbers have been going down. Just last month, there were several schools, smaller schools, that struggled to keep their doors open simply because of the sheer number of people impacted by COVID-19. And it wasn't just students and teachers. Cafeteria workers, bus drivers were all impacted. We spoke with Superintendent Eddie Tyler earlier today who said they were close to having to shut down some classes or maybe even one of the smaller elementary schools. But fortunately, it seems they have weathered the storm. I'm feeling good about it, but you know, by the time you feel good about it, you know, you wake up the next morning and here comes um, some other kind of uh, name, but we'll deal with it. Now, to help fill in the gaps, folks who have been out of the classroom for years were back in front of students or helping in the cafeteria or driving school buses. Tyler says without their willingness to step up and help out, it could have been a different story. We should have those numbers when we come back and give you more information about this story on News 5 at 6. Live on the Baldwin County Beat, Debbie Williams, WKRG, News 5.